Hey guys, welcome back to another Blender tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how to rotate or duplicate an object, i.e. a cube, around a point. So if you want to use the array modifier to make a perfect circle, or any object that's circular, but you don't want to do every single side, this is a good way to do that. So to do that, we're just going to quickly create our new file, so go to general, and then I'm just going to move this cube over on the x-axis over here, just a little bit. It doesn't matter where you have it, just as long as it's where you want. And hit Control A and apply all transformations which will reset the center to the center of the blend here. And then we're gonna hit Shift A, go down to empty and add a plane axis like so. And then go back onto the cube, go to the modifiers tab, add modifier array, untick relative offset and tick constant offset and also tick object offset and use this eyedropper to select the empty object we just made. And you can click on here and select empty like so. Now if we click back, onto the empty objects we made, like so, and we just hit R and Z to rotate on the Z axis, we can see that when we move this, it rotates perfectly around a circle like that. So if we just make more of these, so let's say we make 10 of these, and then again rotate this on the Z axis, we can start to see we're getting a circle like that. And obviously you can modify this however you want. So you can like select the object like this, grab an edge like this and just move it and that'll move all of them so you get a different kind of shape like that you can see how quickly and easily we made that and you can also just grab say a corner just drag it up like that like so again you can see how quickly we are making this like so and obviously you can mess around with it to get the perfect rotation that you want to get it how you like and you might have these moved out further so if I just move it out like that and then apply that again, we can see we have it further out like so. And if we click on this again, and just keep rotating, we can get whatever we like. So if I hit N, we can see over here, a good one is 30 degrees for a perfect circle. So if I just reset it to zero, and then rotate on the Z by 30 degrees, you can see we're starting to get a perfect circle. We just need more of them. So if we get 12, that's a perfect circle there. And we can just move it in a bit. And then just reset. See that it starts to get to a better circle like that. And again, you can use this for whatever you want. So you can do this and then modify each edge to perfectly build a symmetrical object in a circular motion like this. And it doesn't have to be a complete circle. You can make hexagons, octagons, anything which has perfect lines of symmetry like this which all revolve around one point which is this plane axis here. So again just mess about with this for however you want it to be but I think this is the basic that I'm going to cover in this video so thank you for watching I hope you enjoyed and hope you found it helpful and if you did make sure to like and subscribe down below so thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.